Hi everyone and welcome to our channel. Today's video is about the best and powerful home remedies for acne. Acne is one of the most common skin conditions in the world, affecting an estimated 85% of people at some point in their lives. Conventional acne treatments can be expensive and often have undesirable side effects like dryness, redness, and irritation. This has prompted many people to look into how to cure acne naturally at home. The internet is filled with suggestions, but do natural treatments actually work? This article explores 13 home remedies for acne that are backed by science. What causes acne? Acne starts when the pores in your skin get clogged with oil and dead skin cells. Each pore is connected to a sebaceous gland, which produces an oily substance called sebum. Extra sebum can plug up pores, causing the growth of a bacteria known as Propionibacterium acnes, or P. acnes. Your white blood cells attack P. acnes, leading to skin inflammation and acne. Some cases of acne are more severe than others, but common symptoms include whiteheads, blackheads, and pimples. Many factors contribute to the development of acne, including genetics, diet, stress, hormone changes, and infections. Below are 13 home remedies for acne that you might want to try. 1. Apply Apple Cider Vinegar Apple Cider Vinegar is made by fermenting apple cider, or the unfiltered juice from pressed apples. Like other vinegars, it is known for its ability to fight many types of bacteria and viruses. Apple Cider Vinegar contains several organic acids that have been shown to kill acnes. In particular, Succinic acid has been shown to suppress inflammation caused by P. acnes, which may prevent scarring. Also, lactic acid has been shown to improve the appearance of acne scars. What's more, apple cider vinegar may help dry up the excess oil that causes acne in the first place. How to use it? 1. Mix 1 part apple cider vinegar and 3 parts water. Use more water for sensitive skin. 2. After cleansing, Gently apply the mixture to the skin using a cotton ball. 3. Let sit for 5-20 seconds, rinse with water and pat dry. 4. Repeat this process 1-2 times per day, as needed. It is important to note that applying apple cider vinegar to your skin can cause burns and irritation, so it should always be used in small amounts and diluted with water. 2. Take a zinc supplement. Zinc is an essential nutrient that's important for cell growth, hormone production, metabolism, and immune function. It is also one of the most studied natural treatments for acne. Research shows that people with acne tend to have lower levels of zinc in their blood than those with clear skin. Several studies have shown that taking zinc orally helps reduce acne. In one study, 48 acne patients were given oral zinc supplements three times per day. After eight weeks, 38 patients experienced an 8100% reduction in acne. The optimal dosage of zinc for acne has not been established, but several studies have shown a significant reduction of acne using 30-45 mg of elemental zinc per day. Elemental zinc refers to the amount of zinc that's present in the compound. Zinc is available in many forms, and each one contains a different amount of elemental zinc. Zinc oxide contains the highest amount of elemental zinc at 80%. The recommended safe upper limit of zinc is 40 mg per day, so it is probably best to not exceed that amount unless under the supervision of a medical doctor. Taking too much zinc may cause adverse effects, including stomach pain and gut irritation. It is also important to note that applying zinc to the skin has not been shown to be effective. This may be because zinc is not effectively absorbed through the skin. 3. Make a honey and cinnamon mask. Both honey and cinnamon are excellent sources of antioxidants. Studies have found applying antioxidants to the skin is more effective at reducing acne than benzoyl peroxide and retinoids. These are two common acne medications for the skin that have antibacterial properties. The antioxidants studied were vitamin B3, linoleic omega-6 fatty acid and sodium ascorbyl phosphate, SAP, which is a vitamin C derivative. These specific antioxidants are not found in honey or cinnamon, but there is a possibility that other antioxidants may have a similar effect. Honey and cinnamon also have the ability to fight bacteria and reduce inflammation, which are two factors that trigger acne. 
while the anti-inflammatory, antioxidant, and antibacterial properties of honey and cinnamon may benefit acne-prone skin, no studies exist on their ability to treat acne. How to make a honey and cinnamon mask? Mix 2 tablespoons honey and 1 teaspoon cinnamon together to form a paste. After cleansing, apply the mask to your face and leave it on for 10-15 minutes. Rinse the mask off completely and pat your face dry. 4. Spot Treat with Tea Tree Oil Tea tree oil is an essential oil that is extracted from the leaves of Melaleuca alternifolia, a small tree native to Australia. It is well known for its ability to fight bacteria and reduce skin inflammation. What's more, several studies show that applying 5% tea tree oil to the skin effectively reduces acne. When compared to 5% benzoyl peroxide, 5% tea tree oil did not act as quickly, but it did significantly improve acne after three months of use. It also resulted in fewer adverse effects like dryness, irritation, and burning, compared to benzoyl peroxide. Tea tree oil is very potent, so always dilute it before applying it to your skin. How to use it? Mix one part tea tree oil with nine parts water. Dip a cotton swab into the mixture and apply it to affected areas. Apply moisturizer if desired. Repeat this process one two times per day, as needed. 5. Apply green tea to your skin. Green tea is very high in antioxidants, and drinking it can promote good health. There aren't any studies exploring the benefits of drinking green tea when it comes to acne, but applying it directly to the skin has been shown to help. This is likely because the flavonoids and tannins in green tea are known to help fight bacteria and reduce inflammation, which are two main causes of acne. The major antioxidant in green tea epigallocatechin 3 gallate EGCG, has been shown to reduce sebum production, fight inflammation, and inhibit the growth of acnes in individuals with acne-prone skin. Multiple studies have shown that applying a 2-3% green tea extract to the skin significantly reduces sebum production and pimples in those with acne. You can buy creams and lotions that contain green tea, but it is just as easy to make your own mixture at home. How to use it? Steep green tea in boiling water for 3-4 minutes. Allow tea to cool. Using a cotton ball, apply tea to skin or pour into a spray bottle to spritz on. Allow to dry, then rinse with water and pat dry. You can also add the remaining tea leaves to honey and make a mask. Even though there isn't any evidence that drinking green tea can fight acne, some research suggests it may still be beneficial. For example, drinking green tea has been shown to lower blood sugar and insulin levels, which are factors that can contribute to the development of acne. Kindly don't forget to click on the button below to subscribe and hit the bell to be notified about the newest videos. 6. Moisturize with Aloe Vera Aloe Vera is a tropical plant whose leaves produce a clear gel. The gel is often added to lotions, creams, ointments and soaps. It's commonly used to treat abrasions, rashes, burns, and other skin conditions. When applied to the skin, aloe vera gel can help heal wounds, treat burns, and fight inflammation. Aloe vera also contains salicylic acid and sulfur, which are both used extensively in the treatment of acne. Several studies have shown that applying salicylic acid to the skin significantly reduces acne. Similarly, applying sulfur has been proven to be an effective acne treatment. While research shows great promise, the anti-acne benefits of aloe vera itself require further scientific evidence. How to use it? Scrape the gel from the aloe plant out with a spoon. Apply gel directly to clean skin as a moisturizer. Repeat one two times per day, or as desired. You can also buy aloe vera gel from the store, but make sure it is pure aloe without any added ingredients. 7. Take a fish oil supplement. Omega-3 fatty acids are incredibly healthy fats that offer a multitude of health benefits. You must get these fats from your diet, but research shows that most people who eat a standard Western diet don't get enough of them. Fish oils contain two main types of omega-3 fatty acids, icosapentaenoic acid, EPA, and dicosahexaenoic acid, DHA. EPA benefits the skin in several ways, including managing oil production 
maintaining adequate hydration and preventing acne. High levels of EPA and DHA have been shown to decrease inflammatory factors, which may reduce the risk of acne. In one study, 45 individuals with acne were given omega-3 fatty acid supplements containing both EPA and DHA daily. After 10 weeks, acne decreased significantly. There is no specific recommended daily intake of omega-3 fatty acids, but most health organizations recommend healthy adults consume a minimum of 25500 mg of combined EPA and DHA daily. You can also get omega-3 fatty acids by eating salmon, sardines, anchovies, walnuts, chia seeds, and ground flax seeds. 8. Exfoliate regularly. Exfoliation is the process of removing the top layer of dead skin cells. It can be achieved mechanically by using a brush or scrub to physically remove the cells. Alternatively, it can be removed chemically by applying an acid that dissolves them. Exfoliation is believed to improve acne by removing the skin cells that clog up pores. It is also believed to make acne treatments for the skin more effective by allowing them to penetrate deeper, once the topmost layer of skin is removed. Unfortunately, the research on exfoliation and its ability to treat acne is limited. Some studies show that microdermabrasion, which is a method of exfoliation, can improve the skin's appearance, including some cases of acne scarring. In one small study, 25 patients with acne received 8 microdermabrasion treatments at weekly intervals. Based on before and after photos, this helped improve acne. 96% of the participants were pleased with the results and would recommend the procedure to others. Yet while these results indicate that exfoliation may improve acne, more research is needed. There are a wide variety of exfoliation products available in stores and online, but it's just as easy to make a scrub at home using sugar or salt. How to make a scrub at home? Mix equal parts sugar, or salt, and coconut oil. Scrub skin with mixture and rinse well. Exfoliate as often as desired up to once daily. 9. Follow a low glycemic load diet. The relationship between diet and acne has been debated for years. Recent evidence suggests that dietary factors, such as insulin and glycemic index, may be associated with acne. A food's glycemic index, GI, is a measure of how quickly it raises blood sugar. Eating high GI foods causes a spike in insulin, which is thought to increase sebum production. Because of this, high GI foods are believed to have a direct effect on the development and severity of acne. Foods with a high glycemic index include white bread, sugary soft drinks, cakes, donuts, pastries, candies, sugary breakfast cereals and other processed foods. Foods with a low glycemic index include fruits, vegetables, legumes, nuts and whole or minimally processed grains. In one study, 43 people followed either a high or low glycemic diet. After 12 weeks, the individuals consuming a low glycemic diet had a significant improvement in both acne and insulin sensitivity, compared to those eating carb-dense foods. Another study with 31 participants yielded similar results. These small studies suggest that a low glycemic diet may be helpful for individuals with acne prone skin, but further research is needed. 10. Cut back on dairy. The relationship between dairy and acne is highly controversial. Drinking milk and consuming dairy products exposes you to hormones, which may cause hormonal changes and lead to acne. Two large studies reported that higher levels of milk consumption were associated with acne. However, Participants self-reported the data in both of these studies, so more research needs to be done in order to establish a true causal relationship. 11. Reduce stress. The hormones released during periods of stress may increase sebum production and skin inflammation, making acne worse. In fact, multiple studies have linked stress to an increase in acne severity. What's more, stress can slow wound healing by up to 40% which may slow the repair of acne lesions. Certain relaxation and stress reduction treatments have been shown to improve acne, but more research needs to be done. Ways to reduce stress Get more sleep Engage in physical activity Practice yoga Meditate 
Take deep breaths. 12. Exercise regularly. Exercise promotes healthy blood circulation. The increase in blood flow helps nourish the skin cells, which may help prevent and heal acne. Exercise also plays a role in hormone regulation. Several studies have shown that exercise can decrease stress and anxiety, both of which are factors that can contribute to the development of acne. It's recommended that healthy adults exercise for 30 minutes 3-5 times per week. This can include walking, hiking, running, and lifting weights. Acne is a common problem with a number of underlying causes. However, conventional treatments can cause dryness, redness, and irritation. Fortunately, many natural remedies can also be effective. The home remedies listed in this article may not work for everyone, but they just might be worth a try. Nevertheless, you may want to consult a dermatologist if you have severe acne. Thank you for watching. Kindly don't forget to click on the button below to subscribe and hit the bell to be notified about the newest videos.